The IZT-S1000, a universal tool for generating real-world wideband signals. For the first time ever, it is now possible to combine up to 31 entirely different signals within an instantaneous bandwidth of 120 MHz. Unlike with conventional solutions, there's no need to synthesize some signals offline. This is all performed inside the IZT-S1000 unit itself. This presents several advantages, namely data volumes are hugely reduced and signal duration is not limited in any way. The user can interactively control individual signals during operation and construct any combination of ideal, synthetic or recorded signals. IZT-S1000 – 31 virtual signal generators in a single unit. The revolutionary architecture and functionality of the IZT-S1000 enables the use of 31 virtual signal generators, for which the user can define characteristics such as signal content or real-time modulation IQ data streams. After generation, the digital signals are subsequently forwarded to one of two RF synthesizers. These can be tuned in a range from 9 kHz to 3 GHz. Each of the RF outputs has a noise source, so that the user can easily determine the signal-to-noise ratio as well as the noise floor. Especially when it comes to testing receivers which support more than one standard, the IZT-S1000 can reveal its true strengths. To demonstrate, we'll start off with a test scenario consisting of three DAB ensembles each with different frequencies and power levels. The power and frequency of all the signals can be independently adjusted during operation. To demonstrate this, we'll use the signal on the right-hand side and change the power level. You can see that even at higher power levels, the signal has no spurious emissions and shows a high degree of spectral purity. Now we'll add an interfering signal to our scenario. We will continue to modify the power and frequency of the interfering signal until we see its impact on the third DAB signal on the right-hand side. The right DAB signal is now significantly affected. Of course, the power level can continue to be modified. In a typical setup, the user would need four signal generators for this test scenario, whereas with the IZT-S1000, only a single piece of equipment is necessary. Here we can see a satellite broadcast signal containing eight individual signals. The IZT-S1000 has no problem in simultaneously generating the carrier signals. In this example, we will maintain the same frequencies and only adjust the power levels. We will change the terrestrial low band signal from minus 40 dBm to minus 65 dBm. With the IZT-S1000, the user can construct very complex scenarios. In this test setup, we can see three synthetic FM signals, three AM aviation signals, and three DAB ensembles. Individual signal power levels can be continuously modified during signal generation, without causing any interruptions. IZT's revolutionary multi-channel signal generator for testing complex radio systems enables easy simulation of realistic signals for frequency hopping. If the hopping sequence is chosen properly, frequency hopping provides additional security to the communication and protection against jamming. By utilizing the full profile functionality of the IZT-S1000, the module efficiently generates hopping networks with a hop rate of over 2,000 hops per second. Frequency hopping requires a much wider overall bandwidth than is needed for the transmission of the same information with only a single carrier frequency. By taking advantage of the impressive 120 MHz instantaneous bandwidth provided by the IZT-S1000, the user can continuously change the center frequency on each of the virtual signal generators. In our next test scenario, we will demonstrate a longer recording of a complete broadcast spectrum with an interfering signal, as is necessary when testing the reception qualities of a car radio. On the map, we can follow the recording location of the test vehicle and identify areas with poor signal reception. Now the interfering signal is added. This means we switch on an HD signal and increase the power in increments of 10 and 20. We effectively simulate the measurement of a safety distance, 
whereby in the second step, we increase the frequency from 93.9 MHz to 94.1 MHz and then reduce it back down to 93.9 MHz. With modern radios, testing has to be carried out under real-life conditions to ensure that their functionality meets all relevant radio standards. Such tests can include conventional AM and FM radio signals, DVB-T, DAB, HD radio, as well as satellite radio. In order to construct today's demanding advanced testing scenarios, the IZT-S1000, with its revolutionary virtual component-optimized architecture, and IZT's patented signal processing algorithms, combine multiple technologies into a single piece of testing equipment. IZT-S1000. Efficient. Flexible. Easy to use.